our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. We set it inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, flying out of the blue corner, Monster. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Michael Payne. You ready to fight? Ready. Let's go. All right, here we go with round one, and it is great to see Michael Venom Page rocking the UFC gloves here tonight. One of the best fighters to cross over from another big promotion. But he doesn't really focus too much on that, free agent signee or otherwise. He believes he's going to be the best welterweight in the world. And no rest for the weary, right? They are giving him appreciable, high-level top 15 challenges right out of the street. Oh, brilliant execution to land the roundhouse. Great job setting up that high kick. Oh, and he lands another leg kick there. He's already landed several in this round, and the damage is really starting to take its toll. Yeah, it's really starting to take its toll. And you watch the opponent walking gingerly on his legs, and one big tell that you're starting to really do well with your leg kicks is when your opponent starts to switch stances. Right. Watch for a stance switch very soon. I mean, these guys are living yeah. well. Big he lands. And now some separation. Oh, jab splits the guard beautifully there. Man, no feeling out process whatsoever. These strikers are getting after it early. They don't like each other, and they are trying to get the opponent out of there right away. Oh! Strong outside leg kick. With authority, the body. Oh my goodness. That hook was bad. Missed with that right hand. Another nice kick there. Solid series of kicks. They're all landing now. Oh, that's a brutal cut on his nose there. He is bleeding. to watch heavy leg kick lands flush. Beautiful combination. Upper cut to the head. Continuing to go to the head. Nice jab by Page. That's a flush elbow from the bottom. Well played. Ooh, heel hook attempt now, and it looks locked in. Oh, I don't know. That heel hook looks tight. Nice strike from bottom position. Page gets back up here. Oh, that hurts to watch. Another leg kick lands flush, really causing a lot of damage to those legs of his opponent. Yeah, he's doing a great job of landing the leg kicks for the opponent. He needs to start trying to relax. Relaxation allows you to check kicks. If you're tense, if you're biting on feints, if you're biting on the guy just throwing jabs up at your head, you're not going to check kicks. Relax, stay comfortable. Recognize who's coming in your direction. Hardy gets the takedown now, DC. We'll see what he can do in this advantageous spot. He's set going hard to try to get the heel hook. Heel hook looks tight. Oh, that's got to be it. Now trying to escape, and he does. He freed his knee. Got his leg all the way to the opposite side. Now, opponent has your back, but you're in a much better position. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Oh, look at that lead left punch. But if I rock a guy to that extent, I feel like I'm closing the show. Absolutely. You got to go close the show if you get a guy hurt that. Oh, he's hurt again. What a fight. 
so the blood really starting to flow. Every time that area gets targeted, that cut's getting worse. It's getting worse and worse, and you see the blood starting to come down. That is when you start to watch the fighter to see what type of effect it's starting to take on him, whether or not he's reaching for it, whether or not he's confused by where it's at. We gotta start to watch his reactions now as we go forward. Round one winding down here. over he got knocked down just before you heard the horn and of course he's only got 60 seconds with which to recover not a lot of time to get his head back into this one that was his best shots he took them no problem all right so a big knockdown in that last round dc will show you the replay nearly had him out of there he almost had him out he had him gone he hurt him real bad he thought the fight was over but the night will go on the dance continues will this be the final dance Ready to fight? Ready. Go. All right. Round two. Nice block. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Both fighters invoking damage on the other one. Yes, we knew this would be very competitive. We knew that this was a tough fight. We knew that both guys would be very evenly matched in this fight. But we didn't expect to see this type of a war between these two guys. That's a beautiful body kick. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Caught that kick there. And he continues to work the body here. And do a work with the jab. Well, good news, bad news, right? The strike there lands, but just not much steam on it because his gas tank seems to be on the verge of empty. The gas tank is completely empty. All that button mash did you no good. You wasted your energy. You wasted your time. Now it's just a matter of when your opponent decides to finish. Man, that is loud. Another strike lands for the kickboxer. He really found that flow state pretty early in this fight, and he hasn't looked back. He found it really early. And when this guy gets into his groove, he is held on wheels. And right now he is showing why he is such a high-level, high-regarded kickboxer. He is outclassing this guy. Oh, it landed. He hurt him. Oh, my goodness. Both fighters throwing heat now. All right, so you see some redness on that calf. Maybe he's starting to slow down a little bit. It looks like he is. Starting to really hurt him. So, fighter a little bit stunned, holding on to him now, not doing a ton, just looking to recover. Changes his stance. Throws that team. You catch a body kick, but you gotta step off to the side. You just can't take it clean. Just over two minutes to go in round two. Leading now, nasty cut on his nose. Nice job by him defensively there. Big body kick. Looking to land the right just out of range. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while. Staying busy from bottom position here. 
Oh, look at that high level grappling as the fighter reverses. Setting up the submission. Ooh, that's tight. I'd be tight. It's starting to get really tight in there. Ooh, what's he doing? Now he goes belly down. He turns down to try to get all of his weight on that arm. Then out of the tap. Inside control, you got a ton of options. He goes, he's on belly. Big ground and pound. Oh, a multitude of elbows raining down. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Page. All right, seems as though his sole focus is attacking that cut. And man, it's getting bad now. A lot of blood flow. Yeah, as it should be. Right, he should be focused on getting to that cut, making his opponent pay. He did the work. He opened up the cut. Now it's on him to continue on the path and make the ringside position come in here to try to stop this fight. 30 seconds to go in the round. Well, missed on that one. 20 seconds left. Kick right over that right elbow. Oh! So the round is over, and you see the cut man not wasting any time as the fighter makes his way back to the stool. The cut man will try to shut that cut on the bridge of his nose and prevent it from becoming a factor here moving forward. All right, so there's the horn. He got knocked down by a punch in that round, but he is able to survive. We'll see if they can make some adjustments. He's as tough as they come. He took that shot, and he kept plodding forward. He got off of his butt. He got himself off of the canvas and tried to get right back to work. But he cannot take many more of these. You don't want to be the guy that's testing how tough that your chin is. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, here we go, third and final round. Nice job defensively. He blocked that punch. Tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Page. Man, his jab is good. There it is. Oh, beautifully timed with the Superman punch. Big power shot there. Well, body language is a great indicator, and that is one confident man right there after a big knockdown in the previous round. He did everything right to secure that knockdown. Perfect setup with the hands. Got the knockdown. Let's see if he can go find the shot that's going to finish the fight. Oh, he lands another debilitating strike to the body, and he continues to punish his opponent's midsection. Had a lot of success with it in the previous round, and picking up exactly where he left off. I mean, you got to be kidding me with that knockout. If that is not the number one play on Sports Center tonight, I'm not sure what would top it. One of the best knockouts we've seen all year. In a very long time, I have not seen someone look this good. He promised us something, and he delivered with that beautiful knockout. We now go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at one minute, six seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Monster! So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen, I am...